Welcome back everyone. I hope you are all doing well and making projects using Arduino. So this tutorial is about communication between Python and uh, Arduino and specifically we will be using Python 3 version and this is one of the reasons that I am making this tutorial because there are tutorials uploaded on the YouTube channel about this uh, topic but uh, they all are using Python 2 version so this tutorial we will in in this tutorial we will be using python 3 so what you need to do is just go in the youtube and then just search how to download uh, what happened latest version of python so here it is now, this is the objectives which we need to accomplish to reach our major objective which is communication between python and arduino so we need to do this following stuff first of all we'll talk about installation and then the last part which is a favorite part of mine and yours also that we will enjoy coding with python and arduino i will demonstrate you line by line uh, by coding in python and in arduino so first let's talk about uh, installation procedure so for installation you need to install a python 3 version and make sure that you install the python 3 version only and uh, then you need to install the pi serial package which will be used to connect arduino and python 3 so just search over the internet about this uh, download installation procedure and you can find the useful links and uh, don't worry about the links i will all uh, i will also provide all the reference regarding all these installation stuff in the description below so let's now quickly jump on to coding so first we will code uh, our arduino and then shift towards uh, python let me save my project of Arduino in a folder I created where it is here and here it is so I'm saving my file as Arduino code now let's begin coding now the question is what we will code so what we will code what we will be doing is we will be, we will be transferring commands from Python to Arduino board as you can see on the screen and we will just turn on and off the LED which is built in on the Arduino in the pin number 13 now pin number 13 is connected with that built-in LED so let's do that stuff so we will code about that uh, project now in this co coding you can see that there is a two functions setup and loop first we will tackle the setup function so here what we do is we just get things ready in this uh, function so what do i mean by this getting things ready for built-in led we will have to write this line of code before using it which is pin mode and it consists of two parameters in the first parameter you will uh, write the pin number which is the 13 and in the next parameter you will write the what does uh, device do now LED is a light emitting device it emits the light so it means that it is an output so here you can write two things output or input now this device is output so we will write uh, output only now you can also write uh, here the built-in uh, reserved the reserved word of this and it is LED built-in instead of using 13 it's your choice the next part is the serial dot begin function and here we have to pass the rate of data transmission which is 9600 bits per second and we will be using this uh, serial monitor here so this serial monitor will be used by python in fact okay so we'll demonstrate also in arduino how it works right now so does that's all setup function is done now let's begin 
to code and loop function so first of all we need a data from user which is one and zero so we will be turning on and off LED using pressing the keyboard by pressing keyboard buttons which is one and zero so for that we need to write this code if serial dot available greater than zero now what does that condition mean now this function serial dot available will return a value based on the commands given by the user if user gives command it will pass uh, some kind of value which would be greater than zero which means that user has entered some value and then we need to do the following now what we need to do is we need to store that uh, command which has been given by user by pressing the keyboard for that we need to create a variable and let's call that variable as integer data okay and let's call it data from user now that's meaningful now this data from user will be then be equal to what the data which we need from the user now for that we have to use another function which is serial dot read this function will get that data and will be and then it will be stored in this variable which is data from user and the next part is just the simplest just write this condition that if data is equals to one we will turn on LED for that we will use digital write function it also has two parameters in the first you pass the pin number or, or I am using the reserve word for that pin number 13 which is LED built in, built in. and the next parameter you will find the you will find the state which is high or low you can also write here one as well and the next is else if data equals to zero same thing digital write LED built-in and low now let's run this code and check whether it runs on the Arduino and what we missed okay here we missed the semicolon uh, another thing oh, 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 oh sorry my bad data from user and now it will surely run where is key upload it And it has successfully uploaded. Now there, let's run it. And let me open the webcam. So here it is. When I'm pressing one, the LED in the built-in Arduino is turned on. And when I press zero, it's off. I press one, and when I press zero, it turns off. So it's working. Now let's quickly jump on to python code